they gotta go. They gotta go. And it's like, I'm not preparing to even deal with you. Like, I'm not even preparing to deal with you and y'all. Welcome back to the Best YouTube channel on the planet. It is me, Ramina Washington, and today we have a Bible talk, Hebrews 11.6. It is impossible to please God without faith. Anyone who wants to come to him must believe that God exists and that he rewards those who sincerely seek him. Um, The face is just, I'm going through a storm right now. And so I'm just like, because I trust you and I love you, Father God, and I have faith in you. I have faith in your word. Um, I've, I've applied your word all throughout my life for the past almost year now. And I just kind of live a life of disobedience until like you kind of snatch me on back from that. And I appreciate that. So it's impossible. I feel like God don't want us to have backup plans. He don't want us to have side agendas. He wants us to sincerely seek him and be right and have righteous hearts. And for me, it's like one thing about me, even when my flesh was filthy, my heart was my heart was pure. I don't have a desire to destroy people for no reason. I don't have a desire. I don't have hatred. I don't have jealousy. I don't suffer from that. So even when I was in sin, I still wanted the best. Now that I'm in, up under satanic attack and I'm fighting these demonic agents and spirits and different things like that, baby, y'all can die by fight. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming for your neck. I'm coming for your neck and your soul and your spirit and everything else in, in the name of Jesus. Because I hate, I have such a hatred for deception and liars and demonic activity. It's ridiculous because I am up under satanic attack. And when I realized I was a victim, if you will, to these particular curses and things, oh no, baby, I'm a victor. I'm, I'm coming up. And so having faith, it's impossible to please God. And it's like, well, you kind of know everything we're doing. I don't suggest that you guys fake your feelings because you can't really fake anything because he's, he knows everything. He knows everything about us, what we do, what we think. But I just encourage you that to just press forward. I encourage you to make plans. Like for me, even though I'm in this particular season, it's something that I wanted to do in my home. And I'm like, okay, well, Father God, I'm just going to wait until I get this, 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 this news before I do this, 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 this. And Father God wants me, go ahead. No, go ahead and order it. Go ahead and get it. Go ahead and do it. Even though I'm still in a storm, I'm going to be obedient and I'm going to actively walk in who I intend to be after the storm is over. And I feel like that will be encouraging and it will just show Father God that I can't turn back because I'm not looking forward to a future in this particular realm and this, but not round, but this particular like area with these people. I mean, I'm, I am, they gotta go. They gotta go. And it's like, I'm not preparing to even deal with you. Like I'm not even preparing to deal with you and y'all in the upcoming months, like y'all gonna fly off the cliff in the name of Yeshua and y'all gotta go because, and I, I'm, I'm big on just being separated. I'm big on light and darkness cannot mix, Second Corinthians 6. I'm big on keeping me separated, keeping my, my, my baby separated, keeping uncleanliness out, keeping the dark out and killing the dark by fire because I gotta go. Um... Yeah, so it's impossible to, and I feel like when you serve two masters, when you say you trust God, but then you're doing something else or going to a deity or a demon for answers, that's not trusting God. Trust the Lord with all your heart, lean not to your own understanding, but in all of your ways, acknowledge him and he will direct your path. Direct me. I'm sad. It's working out. Yeah, I know I'm going to talk about it a little bit later. I wish you guys nothing but the best. Peace and positive vibes. Bye.